This is a fun 12 minute dance style cardio workout that you are going to love. What I want you to do is just start marching on the spot for me now. So that is part of your warm up. Now today I'm going to be doing a workout that you're going to really enjoy. We're going to be burning calories, increasing your fitness and the idea is even if you can't dance you're going to love this. I cannot dance at all but we're going to have a go together you and I. So I'm going to show you now in slow motion the first move coming up for about 15 seconds we're doing these hip swings with the arms up, going from side to side. Then we're gonna do a step out and sweep with the arms. You step out and sweep with the arm. You do that for around 15 seconds. We're gonna repeat it twice. So let's get ready. We're gonna start off with that first move for me. So we're gonna do those hip swings and now take the arms from side to side. All right, so today is all about fun, but I'm gonna get your heart rate up. We are training together. We are gonna have fun. We are gonna feel amazing. So keep going now. Let's take it to that side sweep. So you sweep the arm away and you're stepping that foot. That's good. Just keep going. And we've got so many different moves today. And the more you do this workout, the more familiar you will become with each move. Let's get ready for those hip and arm swells again. So just keeping that going, land softly. And the great thing is travel around the room, you know, put some music on as well. Let's make sure we have fun with this workout. And we're gonna get ready again to do those arm sweeps and that step, let's step it out and take the arm away. Now you can see the next move coming up. Now for the next one, we're gonna go straight into it. If you want to just start off with working on the legs and you can bring the arms in when you feel comfortable with the lower body movement. So you are going to do two side steps. So we're going to get ready to step it one, two, and then just take the foot behind. And when you're ready, just bring in the arms. So you're just circling the arms. You're kind of keeping the palms facing down. So this one now we're doing for a duration of 60 seconds in total and travel around the room, which is really good. And remember the benefit of exercise is it looks after our mental health, our physical health, how we feel, how we look, everything for our energy. It's just such an important thing that we wanna focus on doing every day. All right, let's just keep going and definitely come and find me on Facebook, also on Instagram. Right, so we've got another 20 seconds to go. For the last 15 seconds, you'll see the next move coming up. So the next one, we are doing a heel tap and a clap. And then from that, we're doing this heel toe. So as if you're standing, running on the spot, just taking the heel toes up, alternating. And it's a really fun move. So let's go three, take it two and one. So let's go with the heel taps. And it always focus on keeping your tummy pulled in. And with this, just make sure you keep that supporting knee slightly bent, you're pushing the arm out, and then I'll let you know when we're gonna change to do those heel to toe raises. So we're gonna stay, stay on the spot, but just lift the heel toe up, and then also really work through with your arms as well. Keep that going, keep those tummy muscles pulled in tight, so we're working every single muscle through the body, that's good. Keeping that going, and let's bring it back now to your heel taps, and then so you're just tapping the back of the foot, and you're clapping that hand out in front. That's good, keeping that going. So keep the knees nice and soft, that's good. So we're getting that heart rate up, and we're just gonna finish off again on those heel raises, so it's heel to toe, that's it. Just coming up, alternating. Now you can see the next move coming up, this one we're gonna have fun. We're doing four arm sweeps, and then we're doing three turns and then taking it back to four arm sweeps, two and one. So let's go now, let's sweep the arms across, across, across now, turn it round, one, let's go two and three. Now sweep the arms across, 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 so it's for four and then turn it round the opposite way. Okay, so let's just keep going. So we're doing this again, another one for 60 seconds. And what's really good today also gets your mind thinking. We're looking at doing like coordination, what's also known as motor skills. So it keeps our mind fit as well. And that's why I've deliberately wanted it to be quite choreographed, just so I'm really focusing on that element as well of your fitness. All right, that's good, let's keep it going. You've got your last 20 seconds coming up. And then remember for those last 15, you get a preview of that next move coming up. So the next one, this is a lovely one. It's just a step forwards and a big arm sweep. So we travel it forwards for four and then back for four. Let's go five, take it four, and last three, 
two and one. So now travel it in front and reach up nice and high. It's a really lovely move this. So you can see here, you're working every single muscle through your body. That's good, reach it up and across. And the great thing is, once you've done this workout today and I've coached you through it, you can come back tomorrow and you don't need to have me talking. You could just literally put on your favorite music. You could create a playlist for this actual workout video. This is why I did it for 12 minutes because your average song is around four minutes. So you could choose three songs, three of your favorite songs and have that on. All right, that's good. Let's just keep that going. You are doing really well. Got last 20 seconds, nice big dynamic move. And if at any point there's a move you don't like, you don't understand, then freestyle. Just do your own dancing. So next one coming up, really fun. We're gonna run forwards for four and then do some hip swings. If you don't like running, then just march it forwards for four for me. All right, let's go two and one. So let's travel that forwards for four and then we're gonna do hip swings. And this is where for four, then run it back, you know the drill, then four hips, hip swells. And um, the great thing is, this is amazing. We are doing loads of rotational moves, so I'm actually really working through your core, I'm working through your obliques, through your waist muscles, so it's really lovely for toning up and shaping up as well. All right, that's good. Let's just keep that going. And remember, run it to a different corner in the room. Make the most of the space you've got. You've got last 30 seconds. That's it, and really just think about how you are investing in your future health. Every time you work out is an investment, trust me. All right, that's good. So we've got last 15 seconds to go. So your next move coming up, we're doing a side step and four arm pushes. And actually, we're not, we're doing it a timed one. So you're gonna start with doing that, and then we're doing, that's it, a half star for me. And we do 15 seconds. So just push the arms out in front and it's a side step, keeping that going. Now my timing is really bad, but I'll let you know when we're gonna change on here. So push the arms in front, step the opposite foot out. Now half star for me, just work on one side and then we'll take it back to then doing those side steps and arm pushes. Let's just keep that going, that's good. And let's get ready now to take it back to that side step and arm press, pushing that in front. See, I told you I wasn't a good dancer. I found it really hard with the timing. So let's just keep that going, doing really well. That's good, pushing those arms in front, so it's a little side step. And now let's finish off on the opposite side so here you can see the next move coming up. We are doing four, where we do the waist circles and then four step outs. So we start with doing four of these, four hip circles. Again, this is amazing for your waist and four step outs. So we go four. Once you've done your four, then step one foot across and step the other, extend the arms so they're bend and straightening, then take the arms above and circle. Okay, that's good. And I don't know if you can notice, can you see these trainers? So I got these trainers, especially for you to make it fun. They're actually flashing trainers, but it's so white in the studio, it's hard to see. All right, that's good. So let's just keep that going. And we've got those last 30 seconds. So what we're doing, when it comes to being healthy and fit, the components for fitness are so many things. It's about coordination, balance, flexibility, muscular strength, muscular endurance, cardio vascular health, it is literally everything and we are ticking all those boxes in this workout. So next move coming up is double arm swings and then four step backs. So we take the arms above, you do double arm swings for four and then we're stepping it out for four. And again, it's really great, do travel around your room. So travel that forwards for four, take the arms up and go from one side to the other, do that four times and then we're stepping it out. So as I said, I'm not a dancer, so I find this quite hard doing the audio for this video and teaching you how to do it. But at the end of the day, you're doing this at home. Who cares what we look like? As long as I'm getting your body moving, you're having fun and you're getting fitter, that is the most important thing of all. All right, let's go last 30 seconds on this. So we're nearly done with today's training. That's good. And take those arms out. 
And also I do have another seven, well actually I have another dance workout, a seven minute one, so if you're feeling warmed up after this and you've got lots of energy, then you can do that workout. I'll leave a link to it. All right, so next one we're gonna do is, this is the one we did earlier on, so we'll be ready for this one. We're gonna do those four arm sweeps, so we sweep the arms across and then those three rotations, so four, for me and now circle it round one let's go two and three and step it out two three and four and circle that round that's good and well done so just keep that going and after this we've only got two more moves um, so we are nearly finished with today's workout you've already done nearly 10 minutes so it's amazing so let's just keep going and keep thinking of all those benefits you are becoming the best version of you and what I want to do as your online trainer here on YouTube I just want to give you so many different workouts that every day I have something for you so if you want a more intense workout or if you want one of my indoor walking ones if you want a seated one if you want the yoga inspired stretch I have something literally for you for whatever mood you are feeling in all right we are nearly done and let's go last seven now the next one we're going to do is freestyle so I'm going to show you two alternatives we're just going to go straight into them so these are repeaters so choose the move you want or also if you want to just do your own dancing right now so these are the first two moves I'm going to show you you can alternate from one to the other so we've nearly finished with today's workout we are just doing a couple more minutes on there and then we are done. So the key thing is just make sure you're landing nice and softly on your feet. You can either follow me on the left or follow on the right. That's good. So if you're following on the right, this is what we call actually a grapevine. So it's two side steps and then you step the foot behind and you just add in the arm move. That's good. And if you're following on the left, we're then alternating doing those hamstring kickbacks to then doing those heel taps. This is a really fun one. It's actually really amazing also at working through your arms as well. Keeping those abdominals tight. That's good. All right, so we've got last 10 seconds coming up now. And because I'm a perfectionist, this video still had 40 seconds before we'd reach that 12 minutes. So guess what? We've just got 40 seconds left to go. So this time now, dance like nobody is watching. I want you to go crazy, just enjoy it. You've got super healthy and fit. Follow along with one of my moves, a left or right, or just freestyle, do whatever you want. That's good, you've got last 20 seconds are coming up right now. So this is a really fun workout to do. As I said, what I'll do, I'm going to go into doing stretches with you, but if you want to at the end of the video, then go straight over and do my other seven minute dance style workout. I shall leave a link for you. And let's go four, take it three, two and one and you are done so well done if you enjoyed this workout definitely give it a thumbs up and definitely share it if you liked it and what we're going to do now is do some stretching so if you need to if you want to grab some water hit the pause button and then I'm going to go through a full stretch workout with you right now Okay, so for the first stretch, what we're going to do, we're going to work the calf muscles, so just take one foot behind, just feel the stretch where the arrow is pointing, just hold that there. So the benefits of stretching after a workout helps prevent injury, it's also really good to realign your body. Let's now take that to the opposite leg, so the heel stays down, hands are on the bent leg, just feel that through the back of the lower calf muscle. And definitely, if you like today's video, then do spread the word and share it with your friends. Let's now take that one leg in front. Make sure your hands are on your bent leg for me. And just on the leg that we're stretching, you feel that through the back of the upper thigh. Keep the toes slightly lifted, just holding that. Let's take that to the other leg. Just feeling that stretch. That's good. And if you're not already, you definitely need to subscribe to my channel because I've got so many exciting new workouts coming for you guys soon. Make sure you've got your supporting knees uh, slightly bent for me. Feel that stretch down the front of the thigh. And so now we're just working through that quadricep, just stretching through. Okay, that's good. Holding that there. And if you need to, you can always use a hand by the wall for balance. This time now let's stretch through your back. Just take your arms in front. Imagine you're hugging a big beach ball and we've worked the arms a lot today. Now bring them around in front. Let's just get a lovely stretch through your chest. 
holding that there. So as said, today was a full body workout. Now let's just take one hand in between the shoulder blades, just holding that down. And now let's take that to the other side. So we're just getting that lovely stretch through the back of the upper arm. So well done, that is the workout complete. So as I said, if you like it, please share it. And don't forget, come and join this amazing community, Lucy's Squad. We are growing, I have something for everyone. We are all equal, we are all on this journey together. So come and find us, or find me on Instagram at Lucy Wyndham Reid, and then the Facebook group as well, which is Lucy's Squad. And don't forget, we also have the Lucy's Squad clothing. Everything is available all on my website at lwrfitness.com.